Okay, so in this video, we're going to talk about manual attendance and booking. Uh, and I'm going to start with the most basic uh, way to attend with Imperfect Mind. Uh, now, obviously, we have scanners, and you can attend through barcode scanners, uh, give your students membership cards, and so on. Uh, we'll talk about that in another video. This is just manual attendance we're going to talk about right now. Now, currently, we're looking at our contacts here. Uh, when, we, when we want to do manual attendance, we need to go to the calendar. We click the calendar and it opens up. Uh, now, I always like the week view when I'm doing this. I like to see the week uh, ahead of me. You can obviously change these views and look at the month and so on or just look at the specific day. Uh, but I like the week. I like to see the week ahead of me. And from here, I see all of my classes here uh, that I have Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, and so on. And from here, if, say, for instance, I wanted to log attendance to the MMA class, I could simply click it. And I would only edit this occurrence because I'm just logging attendance to this one class. I'm not logging attendance week after week after week. Uh, that would be the series. The series would be all of the classes in the future as well. So in this case, I would simply select edit only this occurrence. Now from here, I just have to make sure I click on attendees on the left. I click attendees and I can simply type in somebody's name. I can say, for instance, type in the first few letters, it finds them, and then I can simply click Add, and it will attend them. I can continue to do this and just type in the first few letters, and I can even hit Enter on my keyboard, and we'll enter them just as quickly. Now, should I make a mistake, I can always delete them off and get rid of them. Uh, and you can see right away, it updates the attendee list immediately. You don't have to worry about saving, it's instant. Now that's the simplest way to log attendance. So for those of you who do like a roll call and you just want to log the attendance to a specific class, you always have that option. Now I'll show you another way you can do it. A lot of you like to do it on the iPad now. You've probably heard of a lot of our clients are taking their tablets out on the floor and they're actually logging attendance right on the floor. And you could do it this way. You could just simply take your uh, iPad or whatever tablet device you're using and you could simply type in their name here and attend them this way. But I find it's a little easier to do it this way because you can book students into classes. So you can get a list of all the students who should be there and just simply attend them uh, right from your tablet. And I'll show you how you can do that. So when you're looking at your contacts here, we see we have active students here. We're looking at all contacts. We have all of our active students here, though. You could go straight to your active student view if you wanted to do this. But you can book multiple people into a class. You can book, say, for instance, Alex. We could take Andrew, James, and we could take, say, for instance, Kevin. You could take as many people as you want, or you could simply select right here next to photo and would highlight everybody. We could book everybody into a class at once. But say we're just going to take these select individuals. From here, we check them and we simply click schedule. Now, we click schedule, it takes us directly into the calendar now. So say, for instance, if I wanted to go and let's say um, I have a yoga class uh, that I have coming up, I could book them directly into the yoga class. So say, for instance, here I look for my yoga class and I see I have the adult yoga here. I could simply select this class and I could simply click edit the series. Now, I edit the series because I want to book them into all of the classes. Now, again, when we're logging attendance, we only go into the occurrence. But when we're booking them for classes, we want to book them to all the classes in the future. So we would click Edit the Series. From there, it instantly takes all the people that we selected and it books them into class now. So when I go back to the calendar now, and I go to the class, I can simply go on my tablet device, select the, select the class, hit edit only the occurrence and from here I can just simply touch and attend touch and attend whoever shows up and if say for instance they don't we can leave them as booked and again if we make a mistake you can always change it back and it instantly updates the attendee list 